as affordable as you could get while smelling and likable and good at the same time. We gotta go mine. We gotta go mine. Hey, what's up guys? This is Josh here. I just wanted to do a review today on this Jaguar Classic Gold Fragrance Review. Now this fragrance was recommended by a few people. This one is ridiculously cheap. I guess the other Jaguar fragrance, Jaguar Pace, was actually really cheap too. This one is super cheap. I think it's like $12, $13, or $14 shipped. I think I got this on eBay, but everywhere I was looking, you know, pretty much was really cheap. And most of the places they give you the free shipping, that's about the same price. It's almost like how could they produce this and, you know, ship this for such a cheap price? I don't get it, but nonetheless, it is available to us now. Hopefully it doesn't go up in price. Jerry DNY419 from Instagram. He recommended this to me and a few other people did. If I find those people, I'll, I'll put those people down there as well. Yeah, to me, honest, like when I was spraying it, it really just reminded me of 1 million. But to be honest, 1 million doesn't smell that bad, especially for something so cheap. If you're going to get a 1 million style smell for 12 and 14 dollars i think that's pretty good so i sprayed it against a few other 1 million clones that i had this one seems to have a little bit of a perry ellis m style vibe as well as the 1 million style vibe i would say it's about 80 percent 1 million and then 20 percent of that perry ellis m that's just what i get for me but to be honest perry ellis m has this off-putting vibe that I don't really like at all. I smell a little bit of that in this one, not much at all, and I only really smell it when I was comparing it to other 1 million clones. It doesn't really smell like that right away. Right off the bat, it smelled very similar to 1 million. You kind of know 1 million is kind of pulling off a lot of the same characteristics. Very solid for 12 to $14. The notes are vanilla, apple, bergamot, orange blossom, lime, and patchouli. To me, I yeah, it just definitely smells like a sweet nighttime scent. Definitely nothing for the daytime, but it smells good. Kind of like a sexy date night scent just a cold weather scent definitely would fit this one more so i wrote down a few pros and a few cons the pros is that it's ridiculously cheap and it has a likable smell i mean both those two things and something that's 12 to 14 dollars you really can't go wrong it, it's not just cheap it's ridiculously cheap so it's great the cons is that it has average projection the, the projection is like okay right down the middle for a men's style fragrance it's not super good in the high heat and it's not the most unique thing that i've ever smelled this scent is very likable it's not too, too many things you're going to say bad about it. I mean, as an experienced fragrance collector, yeah, we're going to have some issues with it. But the only cons I really have is that it has average projection, not insane. It's not good in the super high heat, but most sweet fragrances, most date night fragrances aren't good in the super high heat. So it's not really knocking this one at all. This isn't the most unique thing I've ever smelled, but it's still very, very solid smelling. And I would say it's very, very likable. If I were to give it a smell rating, I'd give it a solid 7.5 out of 10, right down the middle. I didn't really feel like, you know, this deserved as low as a seven, just a 7.5, super solid smell. I would say the likability is between an eight to an 8.5. This is where this fragrance shines. It's just very, very likable. It's definitely a strong point. And then longevity and projection, 6.5 to a seven, very, very average, right down the middle. It did last for a long time. I'll say you get maybe like you get about an hour and a half projection maybe two hours of projection and then this lasts on the skin eight to nine hours it, it actually did um, have a noticeable smell on my skin for a while but then at the same time i smelled it way longer in the night and it was definitely gone it's right down the middle style longevity projection very very good for 12 to 14 dollars if you're somebody who wants something super 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 cheap as affordable as you could get while smelling likable and good at the same time let me know what you think of jaguar classic gold should i try out any other fragrances from jaguar should I try out any other cheapies i'll be very interested to see down below thank you guys so much for recommending me these great fragrances we're on the road to 25,000 subscribers and i couldn't do that any of you guys help you guys are the best i'm having a great day out here hopefully having a great day at home see you all in the next video peace